Hey guys, so um, I'm going to be just doing a quick little campaign here. I'm um, going to be starting a Prussia campaign. So I'm on normal difficulty. I already created the world, so I don't have to sit through that crap. Normal difficulty, um, Imperial Destroyer. Bandits is also enabled, um, I believe I left everything on, I'm not sure about that, I'll have to double check, probably notify you in a later video, at some point, um, yeah, so that's about it, I'm just gonna jump right into it here. I actually have not tried doing Prussia before, so this is all completely new to me. Just jumping straight in. So far, I've done France, Britain, and France. I like conquered all of Europe, and then I kind of got bored after that. Um. In France, Britain. Um. I think I started Spain, but didn't really like that one. I also tried doing a um. Malta or um, Knights of Saint John. Campaign that didn't work out too great. Um, I think I took Islamic camera right, but yeah. Okay, so just gonna kind of check out my stats and all. Okay, so just by default, like two, one Protestant um monarchy. Okay, I'm allied with a lot of people. Stat war with um, pirates so far. Okay, so um, what I'm planning to do is kind of like when I start off, just I guess follow history and um, like whip Poland's ass, but yeah. Um, okay, so. Denmark likes me. Okay, apparently they have no one there. Um, okay. Let's see. We get two places by default, apparently. Um, I guess I'm kind of allied with everyone, which really leaves me only with one to get. Um, I guess I can... Capital is unguarded right now. Um, West Prussia is also unguarded, so technically if I wanted I could just take that, but... Uh, okay, I'm definitely gonna make a trade agreement with Austria. Except that no problem. Um, Norway is probably okay. So I think I could ally with them. Like it's okay. I know um Sweden won't, but Sweden hates me for whatever reason. But um okay. Can try to soften that up. Yeah. Okay. Screw you too. Um. I'd rather trade with big guys. Um. Okay. Wait, that worked out well. Um. Savoy. Okay. Yeah, I guess that concludes my stuff. Um, wait, what's that? Okay, that worked. No one can build up alliances because 
You know, I wonder if just... Hmm. Okay. This is kind of unguarded. No. Okay, that's a lot of people. Um... I guess I... Wait, what do I have in here right now? Okay, I guess I'll recruit a general. Um, okay, I could probably take out, okay, so Cortland's a protectorate of Poland, so, um, I'm guessing I'm gonna be at war with them at some point, um, so this could kind of be my base for kind of everything, I guess, um, how far does that range go? Okay. Oh yeah, I also enabled standard movement range, um, in case you didn't notice, but, yeah, um, okay, um, for when I actually, go, and take, um, Going, they're just gonna make them attempt to make them Protestant. Wait, how much is it? It's okay, it's going to take forever, but you know, technically, I could just okay, so assuming. Denmark is good to me. Shit, Denmark sucks. Um. Wait, did I just see that? Okay, we're both allied with Saxony. Um. There's Corland, which no doubt will join them. Um, Russia and. I'm allied with Denmark and Saxony, so I guess I should kind of be worried about Russia, but I think I'll be going to war with them at some point anyway, so I guess I'll just kind of leave them with that for now. Um, yeah. Damn, I hate how their capitals are, like, so spread out. Like, seriously, I'm gonna... End up like walking from there. Like just look at look at this. It's gonna take me forever. And then like ninety percent of them have like no value at all. Um, okay, they don't have regions here anymore. If I could legit take. Poland's capital. It's kind of playing. Well, I'm gonna declare a war on them anyways, so might as well just do that now. Use this option to officially declare war on another nation. However, do not do so without first considering the consequences. Note that the check. <clears throat> okay. Okay. Hmm. At least they didn't join Poland, I guess, but, um, yeah, that's, that's quite a bit. Hanover's not gonna do anything, but. Except, like, close off trade offers or whatever. Um. I might be able to take that actually because it's unguarded right now. Okay. Oh my god, I was half joking when I did that. Okay.
Ah, oh, jeez. Okay. I'm off to a really good start. Um, You can move your gentleman by right clicking on any part of the highlighted area. Okay, um. Kind of looks like it's it. Oh, oh, I get a rake. The rake Did is not no see that. Despite okay. appearances in some cases. But in fact, a roguish ne'er do well used as a spy and saboteur. You may also use him to dispose of rival agents by assassination. <laughs> Clicking on the sabotage button means your agent will attempt to damage a building upon arrival uh, at his destination. Not sure if I want to actually do that. As with um. all subterfuge actions, there is like I said, I um, just started this, so I'm going to be getting a lot of those um, messages. Yeah, Capture Poland. Kind of want to take West Prussia too, but like, yeah. Um, okay, what do I have here? Infantry is. Um, I guess I could take some horsies. Okay, that's all my money. In that case, I'd rather recruit from over here. I'll take a horsey. Wait, um... Oh, these guys are actually fairly strong, but nonetheless, I'm going to take a oh, horse. See, this is a standard one. Um, don't suppose. Okay, yeah. Um, <clears throat> this tab lists all your agents. They're available. Oh, oh I forgot to. Um, status. It can be sorted. Wait, is did pull okay. I'm just gonna get rid of that and put in a church or something with a Protestant. Okay, let's see. What can I get here that would actually be useful to me? So, um, what I'm kind of hoping to achieve in this run-through is, um, I want to, A, just take out Poland, um, I might make an empire to the west, too, um, I'm probably gonna, like, just kind of take, like, parts of Russia, but save the rest for when I have time and money to actually go around. Okay, let's see what they do real quick. Alright, so, um... Yeah. Um... I might attempt to go for France if I'm really feeling lucky, but... For the moment, no. Um... Might go for the Ottomans, um, but... Austria is kind of like in the way for everything, but in like literally every campaign I've done, Austria always gets beat up, so it's usually partly to me, but 
I don't know, we'll see what happens. Um, okay. I'm not worried these people, so I should actually give a crap. The ruling classes have written a letter of demands to your national leader as they are okay. unhappy. Lines broken, workers on strike. Will lead to an organized rebellion against you. Acqui Reorganization. Okay, no. Uh, um, Norway, Russia, Sweden, Denmark, United Provinces, Spain, Austria, Ottomans. Oh. Uh, do not concentrate the construction of military buildings with a single. They like stopped me from killing their school. Okay. Demands. Trade gained. Poland. Oh, sweet. Okay, that's good. Not sure how long that will last, but okay. Um. Yeah. I can I assassinate him? Like, do I actually have the... No, where's my rake? You can move your rake by right-clicking on... Oh, I didn't move him. I thought I... He will move within the extent of it, but no further in one turn. Right-click on a character to interact with him. Okay, I'm just gonna kind of keep him here. Okay, um, currently they have Ukraine now. Not sure what's up with that. Um, these minor nations here I might go for. Although I think they're all like, um, protectorates of the Ottomans, so yeah, I guess I'll be attacking the Ottomans at some point. Um, not exactly sure who Austria would fall to. Because, like, yeah. Um, could probably take them right now. They probably hate me also. Um, <laughs> what does this? Upgrading the road system within a region will increase its trade capability. Oh, it's unaffordable. Better quality roads also allow armies to march further within a turn. How like Prussia has to be um, Protestant, and then they're just like surrounded by Catholics. Like seriously, <clears throat> nice one there. I guess that's kind of the same for like. Oh, okay, yeah, they took Flanders. I don't know why that was no. Like always happens. Um, yes, I know I captured West Prussia. Prussia. Okay, I guess. Prussia is reunited now. Um, yeah, they've kind of got random armies, Poland, just like everywhere. 
got more power than you know. It's for fun, I want to see how prestige is going. 100 military. Um. Like in fourth or something. Oh, Spain, it's up there. Okay. Not seen that before. Set help. No. Okay. Grey Guardian Calendar, yes. That's simply amazing. I don't know, I felt like doing that. Okay, so they're stealing my non existent technology there. Um. Can I recruit anybody? Anywhere? No? Okay. There's a way to like change your religion. Like I know um you can change your government type, which I might consider doing once I get to the like, empire phase. <laughs> Guess I'm done here. It's kind of just a lot of random talking. Um anyways, I know you can kind of um change your government and such, but yeah. I guess like a reformation or something would affect that. I'm not sure how that would work, but it would make sense if like somehow your um, home got like, let's say for my case, converted to Christianity or whatever. And then, yeah. Oh wait, I just realized I don't have a single naval ship oh okay yeah they're really getting mad at me they have like all these random armies just kind of spread around everywhere uh it's pretty rich apparently um That's actually a, um, that's actually a good deal, I think, um, plug there in it, yeah. Okay. really want late campaign to come out for Imperial Destroyer just cuz it's like US and um yeah that'd be really cool I'll probably do a commentary of that when it like legit comes out but uh. I don't really have any ports in each of them. So. The letter of demand to your national leader as they okay, sweet. It's cool. Recruits on strike. Will lead to an organized rebellion against you. Acquiescence at this stage could lead to further demand. Are you serious? Where exactly will you draw them? Did that affect Poland at all? I don't know. Let's look seriously. Okay. So just you get church. 
The construction of libraries. Wait. Oh, okay. Or the French natural. Um, let's see, France is probably going to win that one. Um, let's see, the scandal. Okay, yeah, um, so Poland's going to be rebelling pretty soon. There's actually a good chance they'll take this back, which would suck insanely. Um, my hard work of auto resolving might be at risk. Um, okay. What do I need? Here. Guess I'll. Oh, wait, no, it's not gonna be ready in time. That France campaign that I did would have been great for filming this, like, seriously. Um, Ally declares war. Oh, crap, no. Um, uh, no, I'm going with, definitely going with, um, Austria on that one. Oh my god, I might be able to take Saxony for that. Okay, sweet deal. That would definitely work. I actually, um, like Empire's normal music kind of better than, um, what Darth Maud and Imperial Destroyer put in. Um, although, I'm, oh, wait. Sad boy is on me. Okay, yeah, sure, I'll do that. Got myself a protectorate. Okay, they sold themselves to me, that's cool. Oh, wait, crap, France is probably gonna take them. Damn it, France. So, um, I like, of course, at the other side of Europe, so I'm gonna have to sail some ships over there. <clears throat> Sorry if I seem kind of quiet, like, during this video, I'm just a little bit sick right now, and, um, it's fairly late where I am. So, yeah. Some beat-up pirate ship. Okay. Alright. Rioting has broken out in this region as the low okay. orders have become too unhappy. Cruise riot. Um, either appease the rioters by lowering taxes. Bellion, Poland, rebuild. Okay. Whatever you do, Sweet. where's the um, rebels? Where are they? Okay, right there. Iron infantry's um, some cavalry. 
Okay, that's not that hard. Um, I'm gonna recruit like. One last guy before I like a bunch less guys, okay. Oh god. Boom. I just like lost a lot of control right there. Like that. Um Okay, um, wait, how much? Okay, I'm just gonna replenish them, and I might take this little farm back. Oh wow, that's definitely enough to um, get this guy back. Can I assassinate anyone here? Picking oh wait, no, I did not. Button means okay. your agent will begin spying upon arrival at his destination. Oh wait, that was actually. You will be able to see more information about the buildings and troops inside. As with all okay. actions, Militia. There is a percentage chance of success, and failure may mean capture and execution. Yeah, I can totally take that on. Okay. It's cool. Um, I think I'll also be supporting them. See, yeah, I've totally drawn enough to fend off these rebels. Then my, um, whatever it's called, um, public order will go up. So, yeah, seems cool. Um, steady under fire. Some crap I can't even read. Okay. Don't want to research that. Um, can I... With advances in military thinking and the relevant research, new firing drills will become available to many of your units. Unit commanders will more effectively direct fire on the enemy, resulting in an improved kill rate and a greater impact on morale. Okay, yeah, Russia was already at war with me. Why does France hate them so? <laughs> yeah, they're at war with basically everyone. Okay, I'm gonna have, um... Austria here just oh wait they'd be supporting me I might be able to I'm gonna recruit some Um, I'd say after this turn, I'm probably going to end right there. <laughs> I 
noticed a lot of the flags in Imperial Destroyer, they kind of, I know they were accurate, but they kind of seem like simple, like solid colors and crap, but, and then like the others are like beautiful art, I guess. Oh, okay, I can totally do that now. Thank you, Savoy. Bulls. Losing money hand over fist. Very oh, soon God. there will be no money Bankrupt. left in your treasury. There are several things you can do to lift yourself out of the financial mire. Including oh, my God. Why did I do that? Further trade agreements and trade routes, disbanding units to reduce up the oh, costs, God, I'm or so sending more bad. Indian and merchant fleets to trade theaters. Now, yeah, whatever, I'll just get them back eventually. Okay, the point where you have to, um, oh, damn, okay. Oh my god, Maratha got... Jeez, I legit have- I have never seen that before. Oh my god, Maratha got killed. What the hell? Can tell that how historically accurate this is going to be. Um. I'm going bankrupt. Um, yeah, this is really bad now. Just gonna. Oh, actually, that might be. Yeah, I didn't think so. Um. Yeah, they're gonna rebel. Um, the club killing me off. Like, Okay, um, Saxon got killed. Wait, Brandon, Oh, uh, yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, they'll love me again after this. Um, Unmögliche Aufgabe, Sir. Diese 
Dieses Ziel ist nicht zu erfüllen. Ähm. This is actually a tough one to do, like, some control points would be really helpful, um, as I'm kind of losing control of everybody. Um, full payments. I'm gonna go with that. Like, seriously, I need the money. Jeez, I disbanded like everyone. <sighs> Just gonna kind of make them pay for the moment that does not help in any way. Okay. I'm gonna lose these people, so. It is what get my money's worth. Still bankrupt. Um Okay, I think this is kind of a turning point in only in like 1701. It's like five turns. But, um, yeah, I think I'm gonna stop my episode one right here. So, um, thanks for watching and see you in the near future.